saints and uh, viewers all over the world. I welcome you to Streams of Life International Church, uh, which is found in Manzini, Y2K building, uh, opposite Hudson Center. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Uh, we thank the Lord that even today he has given us another day to celebrate him. To live, the Bible says, uh, this is a, a day that the Lord has made. Let us be glad and, and rejoice in it. Hallelujah. And I believe uh, uh, that God uh, each and every day has got something to say in our lives. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Even today, God has got something to, uh, to say in our day life. My So, uh, I, I, I want to speak briefly about the secret place. Hallelujah. Uh, we thank God uh, that we uh, we are alive even today, uh, in spite or in spite of what was uh, happening. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So uh, I want us to talk about uh, briefly about a uh, uh, secret place which is found uh, in uh, in uh, Psalms 91. Before we proceed. Uh, we, with this uh, uh, we, with this word, I want us uh, to pray. Father, we thank you. We bless your name in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. That you are God, there is no one else uh, besides you, oh Lord. Uh, I'm praying for even the viewers at home that are watching over this, uh, 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 the, the, uh, they're watching over this channel in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. Bless them, Lord. Let the word be a substance into their lives in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. We give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. So let us read um, Psalms 91. He that dwelleth in the secret place of the most, uh, uh, of the most high shall abide under the shade of the Almighty. I will say of the Lord is my refuge and my fortress. My God in, in him will I trust. Surely he shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler and from the noisome pestilence. Blessed be the name. Father, we thank you for the reading of your word in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. God is calling us to a place, a secret place. Blessed be the name of the Lord. And when we speak of a secret place, we speak of a, a, a place of prayer. Blessed be the name. The Bible, the opening scripture that says, He that dwelleth in the secret place of the Most High, meaning he that dwelleth, meaning the one who chooses, uh, the one who chooses to, to dwell in the secret place of the Most High God. My bongo says, So it is a choice but at the same time it is a calling. God is calling us to that place of prayer. Blessed be the name of the Lord. There's so much thing that has happened in this world. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So God in spite of what is going on he's calling us to the place of prayer. Blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. So when we speak of a, a dwelling we, we, we speak of we mean of something to, to remain abide or to have your permanent address, my bongo says, having your permanent address in the realms of the spirit, we speak of we speak of a permanent resident or, or, or to remain when you when you abide or to dwell, you abide, you remain there permanently. You don't just come and go. Blessed be the name of the Lord. It is a permanent address in the realm of the spirit. Blessed be the name. So God is calling us to that place, a secret place. My bongo says so that we can remain in there, not just to come and show up in time of prayer, but always be there, always be found in that secret place. Hallelujah, praise God. And the Bible says, uh, He says, uh, 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 Surely He shall deliver thee from the snare of the fowler. Praise the living Jesus. When we are found in the secret place, God is able to deliver us from the snare of the fowler. Blessed be the name of the Lord. And when we speak of the secret place, we speak of a spiritually uh, geographical location where you access the divinity. Blessed, uh, blessed be the name of 
the Lord. It is a place or it is a spiritual location where you access the divinity. Bless the name of the Lord. So when we speak of the divinity, we speak of uh, uh, the character of God. Blessed be the name. We speak of the character or the nature of God. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So it is in that place where we, 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 we access or we access the divinity. We access the nature and the character uh, of God. It is in that place of uh, prayer. Blessed be the name. Which is the secret place. Uh, hallelujah. So, and number two, num number two, the secret place. Uh, secret place, it, it is the portal of the spirit. So, it is the portal of the, of the spirit. Uh, it is useless to pray under closed heavens. Blessed be the name of the Lord. In the spirit realms, there are portals. Blessed be the name. When we speak of portals, we speak of pathways, we speak of uh, gateways, we speak of doorways. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. So, in the secret place, that's where we are able to open the spirit realm. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name. Because life doesn't begin in the physical realm, but life begins in the spirit. Blessed be a, a, a journey of a Christian should be a spirit journey. It should be a spiritual led journey, not a fleshly led journey. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So, we are spirit being, but living in a body. So, we have to occupy the spirit realm. So, secret place it, it, it is the portal. It is where, it is the portal where you access where you open the spirit, the spirit realm. Blessed be the name. So when the spirit realm has been opened, you are able to legislate there because you have to stand at a certain position. Hallelujah. Praise God. So, 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 when we speak of the secret place, in the secret place, there's so much things that are happening. Blessed be the name. And point number three says it is the platform oh, for exchange between humanity and divinity. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So, in the secret place, it is a, a, it is a, a, a platform where there is an exchange. It is an, a, a, a platform for exchange oh, between humanity and divinity. Bless God. So, when we say humanity and divinity, it. I come to God with my uh, with my burdens. Blessed be the name. I pour out my spirit unto Him. I pour out myself. Blessed be the name. I don't come as a prophet to Him. I don't come as an apostle to Him. I come as I am, as in in the form of a human being, and I meet my my Maker, God. So when I pour out my uh, my, my burdens unto Him, He he is able. Uh, he is able to exchange my burdens with, with his blessings upon my life. I come to him with my poverty, and he will give me riches because Jesus was made poor so that we can be rich. I come to him as a sickly person, but he will come to him as a healer because he was made. Uh, 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 we were healed before. Oh, we even got sick because he by his stripes we were healed. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So when I, when there is an exchange between the humanity and divinity, something comes up from there. The, 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 the product that comes up from there, it is a human divine meaning now you have the character of God. And Paul says, I crucify this flesh each and every day. Blessed be the name Blessed be the name of the Lord. He is saying, I crucify this flesh each and every day. It is no longer I who live it, but Christ liveth in me. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So, it is the platform where we, we exchange our weaknesses. Blessed be the name with his strength. He is able to strengthen us. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name. So, uh, and then point number four, where, that would be my last point. And point number four, 
It is where the flesh is defeated and the spirit is being equipped. Blessed be the name. There is no place where you can defeat your, your flesh unless you stand at the positioning of, 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 of a secret place and then you abide under him, which means you give him the whole of you. And uh, blessed be the name. You give him the whole of you. The flesh, the Bible says, let us not walk according to the desires of the flesh but let us walk according to 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 the spirit blessed be the name of the lord blessed be the name it is in that position of prayer or or, or the secret place where your flesh is being defeated and your spirit is equipped let me tell you something if you are a prayerlessness a, 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 a christian you must know satan is gaining strength against you one thing we must know satan was defeated long time ago but Satan is not a fool. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So for us to be to, to stay in that place, in the secret place, we need to know, we need to go to prayer, we need to decide. Blessed be the name. Because the, our flesh will be defeated and the spirit will be equipped. Blessed be the name of the Lord. God bless you. I believe we shall meet again and continue talking about the secret place. Because it is uh, very, very important for us as Christians to activate the prayer life, to stay. The Bible says, pray without ceasing, blessed be the name. Meaning that we should be always be in the mode of prayer. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Not necessarily wherever you go, you rabababa la la rabababa. No, in the mode of prayer, it is not. Uh, it is not about the rabababa shere la la. Wherever you go, because you have to work do those things. But your mind should be tuned in the mode of prayer. Even the pattern of your thinking should be tuned in the mode of prayer. Blessed be the name of the Lord. So. Uh, so uh, I believe God will touch each and everyone who's watching in the, who's watching this uh, channel so that their prayer life will be activated in that way we are able to be victorious blessed be the name of the Lord Jesus has done all the works for us now it is our role to play blessed be the name of the Lord God bless you I love you we'll see you soon at the same time God bless you